my first big major issue with the Vinfast. Hello Tom, I know about your success, about your YouTube channel. I am sure that you are going to be expanding and growing more and more. Saludos, Tomas. So uh, I'm at the service center here at VinFast. Uh, I had the car about two weeks, two weeks, and I put about 600 kilometers on the car. And this morning, there was a big alarming saying that uh, there's a problem with the battery and I must stop the car immediately and call VinFast right now. VinFast says it's okay, not, not a big problem, you're not gonna die and just drive the car to the service center and we'll take care of it. And here we are and we're gonna find out what exactly happened. So let's take a quick look at the VinFast in the service center. As you can see, they actually have a, uh, a charging station at the service center as well for electric cars. I just came back from the VinFast service center. Apparently the issue that we had was a software issue. All right, so uh, there are actually many things uh, that are not operating normally with the car because the software is not yet quite ready. They told me that I'm on the version 1.5 of the software. I need to go to version 1.6. I assume it will update over the air. It will update automatically. All these issues will just naturally resolve as, as part of the software update. And let me just show you how to tell what version of the software you have in your VinFast car. To find out what version of the software you have, you go to settings and then you go to about cars. I can't really read Vietnamese so I'm assuming that that's what that meant. And then you go to the VIN number of the car and you have to go tap one, two, three, four, five times. And then you go to this engineering mode, right? And then it tells me that I have version 1.5. So I'm waiting for that to update to version 1.6. When that happens, all the problems with uh, what I've experienced this morning should disappear, should not happen again. Now I have to say the whole experience at the VinFast service center has been very, very professional. You know, they, they took care of me quickly and they answered all of my questions. They cleared the error code so that I don't have this, uh, you know, catastrophic uh, battery problem warning message in my face every time I start the car, right? Uh, so they just clear the error and everything is back to normal. And apparently it's just a software problem. And apparently the reason why it was triggered is because I turn on the car and turn off the car and turn on the car and turn off the car maybe you know too frequently and that's what they tell me that's why this issue comes up and uh, it's just a software issue and it can be quickly resolved I you know I, I am in software I, I do software for a living so I totally understand that it takes time to uh, you know fix software issues to test software issues you cannot fix these things in 10 minutes we're talking about software for our car there's safety issues involved here so if you do something quickly and release it out in the public and somebody get into an accident that's terrible so that's why uh, software companies especially for a car manufacturer they have to fix the issue check the code do testing on the road. It takes time to release software. Uh, not just car software, e-commerce software, uh, financial technology software, anything, any software, banking software, you know, you gotta make changes and then you gotta test it thoroughly. So that's why it takes time. Sometimes customers don't understand this. Why, why does it take so long to fix one small issue? Because everything we change in the software could actually break it even worse. That's why we have to test it very carefully. A lot of people don't understand why it takes so long to actually release good quality software. It's exactly because of that. Here we have a fine example of uh, you know a car released to the public and still have software issues. It's not because they're incompetent. It's because software is very, very complicated. It takes time, effort, people, energy, and just a lot of quality check to get good software out. 
and I totally understand the problems with the software in the car and I totally expect it as well and I do know that in due course in good time VinFast will resolve all these issues and let me tell you so far so good it doesn't matter what the girls say you know I love this car you know every time I get into this car I see this V logo you know I'm driving a Vietnamese car and it's great quality and you know it drives like a really fast car too I, I love it I love everything about it especially this V logo it just makes me feel very very proud in summary my car is not gonna explode my battery is not gonna explode everything is fine uh, apparently the issue is just software software update will come and take some fucking action, don't be a fucktard.